it's amazing. I'm the reason. Every Here. 2017 was a pretty awesome year for me. I started working in a field that I absolutely love, which is the world of pro cycling. I'm doing live reportage paintings of the big races, documenting the key moments and the twists and turns as the race unfolds. In general, I would say that the year started, I was working in Camden Market. It was going okay, I was doing pretty well. But I wasn't happy there, I wasn't engaging with enough people. Then I decided to start covering cycling races. Pro move. My career trajectory just went like this for me. The enjoyment went up, the creativity went up, my freedom went up, and also I was engaging with more people and connecting with more people through my work. Unfortunately, I would say that 2017, despite its extremely promising start, middle, and everything else, actually ended on a bit of a bum note. The graph went like this. As a result, I've decided to bounce back even harder into 2018. I'm battening the hatches. I'm sharpening my pencils. I'm tightening the knobs. And I've decided to take this opportunity at the start of 2018 to start some really good new habits. And this video, I'm gonna take you through a few of those which are gonna make 2018 one of them. Slide away. One of my New Year's resolutions is to start taking cold showers. So I think that if you give yourself a little bit of shit in life, it makes you appreciate the good stuff. Yeah, that's definitely cold. <sighs> that was a lot better than yesterday. Yesterday was my first one, there's my second one today, just now. And I focus on the breathing deep and being in the moment. I think that's a, a kind of theme which I see developing in my life. Resolution number two. Do a daily painting. Resolution number two is to paint something from my personal life every single day. This will mainly be from imagination as well, which is not a skill I'm necessarily that good at compared to my level in other things. And when I'm drawing from my imagination, it's really daunting. When I'm set up with the blank canvas in front of me, it scares the crap out of me. <laughs> Once I've done this phase, then I take a picture of it with my iPad and start getting to work on the colouring process. Finally, the third New Year's resolution is to do more of this, making YouTube videos. I really love them. I think the potential reward, the distribution you can get is immense. They force me to have fun while I work because I'm trying to entertain as opposed to just create good images. It adds a new dimension to my work which excites me. It's really creative and it's just something I want to do. It combines video, sound, music. I love that. Creating music is a real passion of mine, as well as doing the art and telling stories. I think it has so much to offer, and although it's a very difficult market to get into and requires a lot of work up front, I want to do it. So New Year's resolution number three is to do more YouTube videos, more vlogs like this. So watch this space, more to come, and I'm really excited about how I'm going to develop creatively. It's going to be cool. Thank you so much for watching. If you've enjoyed this video, then please click the thumbs up button. That lets YouTube know that I'm valuable and it helps me in the ratings and shows me to more people. If you're new around here, then also please click the subscribe button. That means that I will pop up in your news feed so you'll get to see more videos of me if you want to. Thank you so much for watching again, and I will see you very soon. Adios.